It appears American Olympic swimmer Ryan Lochte and his teammate James Fagan may have lied about getting robbed at gunpoint while in Rio. A judge has ordered them to stay in Brazil until the investigation is completed due to their conflicting stories. Now before I go any further, I want to remind you who Ryan Lochte is. This is a video that BuzzFeed put together during the last Olympics. What defines me? Ryan Lochte. Yeah, kind of, kind of stay under the profile, under the radar. I didn't, I didn't do that bad at World Championships. I bet Lochte you knows how to have some fun. Oh, that's for sure. Seven times four. Twenty-one. <laughs> uh, what I was always good at was letting things go through, like through one ear out the other, so to say. I mean, I'm not a big like sentimental guy, like. I don't really cry. The reason why I love swimming is because racing. I know, just because he's bad at interviews doesn't mean he's a liar. But get a load of his account of the robbery. Now legally, I can't show you Olympic footage, so I'm going to have to improvise. But remember, these are all Ryan Lochte's words. We got pulled over in a taxi, and these guys came out with a badge. A police badge. No lights, no nothing. Just a police badge, and they pulled us over. They pulled out their guns, they told the other swimmers to get down on the ground. They got down on the ground. I refused. I was like, we didn't do anything wrong, so I'm not getting on the ground. And then the guy pulled out his gun. He cocked it, put it to my forehead, and he said, get down. And I put my hands up. I was like, whatever. He took our money. He took my wallet. He left my cell phone. He left my credentials. Those are real quotes. Let me repeat. And then the guy pulled out his gun. He cocked it, put it to my forehead, and said, get down and I put my hands up, I was like, whatever. You were like, whatever? A random guy in a foreign country, dressed up as a cop, put a loaded gun to your head, and you were like, whatever. I was like, whatever. And they didn't take your cell phones, really? Robbers went through all the trouble to dress up as cops, and they didn't bother to take your cell phones. Okay, so maybe his account of the night wasn't perfect. That doesn't mean he's lying. But wait, I forgot to mention. Ryan Lochte's wallet was detected in an x-ray scan at Olympic Village just after he said it was stolen. Uh, how did that get there? 